Hi, my name is Ito Blaina and I'm the CTO here at 3D Printler. Uh, so we have a Next Engine scanner and we're going to show you the unboxing of the uh, Next Engine uh, 3D scanner. It's a really cool tool you can use to scan any uh, object, small or large, and then have a file on the PC that you can use to manipulate and design around and so on. So uh, without further ado, we'll see what's inside this box. So first we see in here we have a, a little box with some accessories like your USB cable and a power cord, um, a little football that comes with it so you can start scanning and uh, run some tutorials and learn, and some uh, pens. These are uh, paint pens. And basically, you can use the paint pens to put markings like numbers or figures on your object, which you later use to align the different scans from different angles. And you also get some clay, and as you can see, we've already used ours. The clay uh, is there to help you align the object again. We try to make a object that is uh, non-symmetrical, and this can be used by the, the powerful uh, program that you get with the 3D scanner to do automatic alignment. Uh, so it's a very comprehensive little kit, and it's great. As soon as you get your next engine 3D scanner, you can start scanning and getting some useful material. So if we look a little further, we'll see that we get the scanner. It's a little heavy, but uh, by no means uh, you know, uh, a weightlifting challenge. Now you get two different cameras. These cameras have some filters in front of them that keep changing so that it can pick up textures and color as well, actually. So we were very surprised when we did some of our scans. It picks up uh, you know, even uh, fine details like uh, a small monogram on, on something. And then here you have the, the lasers that uh, trace over the object and get the actual 3D data from it. At the bottom there's a little uh, telephone style port that you can use to connect to a rotating platform so it can do an automatic scan of a, of a 3D object. And another cool thing is that on the bottom here you have a standard uh, threaded fitting for a camera tripod. So you can actually mount the 3D scanner to the tripod and then scan something really large like a car uh, and create a bunch of different little scans and then glue them all together to make you know, your full car model. And then as well on the back here, you've got your USB and, uh, and power connections. So the other thing you get in the box is a turntable. So this turntable plugs into the bottom of the next engine scanner and communicates with it. You can plonk an object on here and then it'll turn and do a 360 scan of the object. Uh, inside the software, there's a whole bunch of settings for what kind of quality scan you want, how many images you want of it, uh, and so on. Again, there's lots of tutorials on their website. Uh, their support is excellent, and, and you can get some really cool scans using just this turntable. And lastly, you have a little turntable support. So this can go onto the turntable for smaller objects, uh, or objects that are maybe a bit weird that you can put on the turntable and move. And you get a little box with the software on it uh, and some warranty stuff and so on. So that was the unboxing of the Next Engine 3D Scanner. Uh, it's a great little system. You can take it out of the box and be scanning within 15-30 uh, minutes, getting some useful scans and uh, have some data that you can design around. Um, and that's it. So if you have any scanning questions, please let us know. Thank you for watching.